Today I want to talk with you about acetaminophen overdose. Jim is a 30-year-old bank manager who was rushed to the emergency department by his brother after he swallowed 25 Tylenol pills, 500 milligrams each. Presently, he's alert and oriented times three, nauseous, and vomited twice with abdominal cramps. His vitals are normal. He's connected to the cardiac monitor and IV access has been attained. What is the first thing I want to know? The first thing I want to know is the time of ingestion. The time of ingestion will determine how I proceed with the management. If the time of ingestion is under two hours, then activated charcoal may be given. If the time of ingestion is beyond two hours, then activated charcoal may not be as beneficial. Activated charcoal prevents the absorption of acetaminophen from the gut. Keep in mind that activated charcoal can induce vomiting, resulting in aspiration. An EKG is performed, which showed normal sinus rhythm. Which labs should I order? I'm going to order the CBC Complete Metabolic Profile, PTPTT, Acetaminophen Level, Aspirin Level, Alcohol, and Toxicology. Ideally, the acetaminophen level should be drawn four hours after ingestion. So if an acetaminophen level is drawn on arrival, then one should be done four hours after ingestion. Liver damage starts to occur after four hours. What time should treatment be started on this patient? Treatment should be started after the the acetaminophen level is known. I gave him N-acetylcysteine intravenously because he was vomiting. Given the medication intravenously is preferred over oral due to vomiting. The loading dose is 150 milligrams per kg in 200 ml of D5 um, w infused over 60 minutes. The maintenance dose is 50 mg per kg in 500 ml D5W over 4 hours and this is followed by 100 mg per kg in 1 liter of D5W infused over 15 hours. It is now 5 hours after ingestion. A serum level is 200 that is a serum acetaminophen level is 200 milligram per liter the paracetamol nomograph shows that jim is in the toxic zone here's the picture jim's level at five hours is definitely in the toxic zone jim is receiving intravenous and acetylcysteine. He remained stable and was admitted to the unit. What is suprotherapeutic ingestion? Suprotherapeutic ingestion is a situation in which a person will constantly self-medicate with Tylenol frequently until they reach a point of overdose. In cases like this, N-acetylcysteine can be started immediately on arrival without waiting for a Tylenol level. In closing, emergency providers should be mindful of the following. Number one, the time of ingestion. Number two, the amount of ingestion if possible. Number three, Tylenol level before treatment in willful overdose. Next, 
treatment may be started immediately in supra-therapeutic overdose, then determine if liver damage has begun, hold activated charcoal if ingestion is beyond two hours, and be aware of the complication of aspiration, and of course, report the incident to poison control. Well, thanks for watching. Please remember to like, share, and subscribe. I wish you well. Good night.